seeing makes me cry Don't understand the reason why All I'm back was for silence Oh Neither she withhold humanity This is our plan for reality Frustration, depression, poverty, insecurity I went to work. I got a judge here with a few one day. It's okay. So you need a minute. I mean, it's all right. Democracy. It's all right. It's all right. It's all right. Yeah. It's all right. I see one when he hold your man. He can answer to himself. Oh. Uh -huh. You understand? Uh -huh. Yes. He can answer to himself. Or would he put in somebody made a gay booty a buffet? Over tele tele amortan. We do over 50, 50 military men mm. because of one, searching for one person. Under democracy, can it happen? Doesn't happen. Near your email. Get back when you do it again. You only born young. My God, deny it again. Tanya Mounia or something like that. I'm going to get the other side. Then you bomb every search everywhere, loot away all our properties. No, it's uncalled for. So we are calling on in the ordinary. The, the local government, uh, uh, Abombisa local government, Imo State, Nigeria, are general to come to our aid. Oh, when the solar, the only Abombisa, Abela here. She had not come. Yeah. Even our representative, uh, Chief uh, Edio Binna, mm. has not visited this place for one Since day. Since then? Yes, for one day. He's representing us in the Imo State House of Assembly, and we have gone to him. I'm begging. But till now, over one month now, I have not visited this place. That is it. That is what we are we are saying. I'm so bad. Yeah. I'm so bad. This is unacceptable and unbearable. This is the second time something like this is happening Imagine in this. The first was in Hid Afuku. How do you justify burning down or destroying a people's property, looting people's valuables? dehumanizing and brutalizing innocent people all in the name of arresting or coming for a suspect. What manner of lawlessness, recklessness and wickedness is this? What kind of country is this? How can those who are meant to protect the citizens be the very ones victimizing them, oppressing, inflicting bodily harms and even killing? This is barbaric. Ndimbise. We need to speak up. We need to act. This can't be swept under the carpet. Therefore, I want to use this medium to call on the stakeholders of Fumbise, our lawyers and security personalities, to sue for justice. Justice must be served to those who perpetrated these atrocities and evil against humanity. More importantly, I'd like to use this medium to solicit for assistance for the affected family. Let's join hands to wipe their tears and sorrow in whichever way we can. To those politicians, those who want to live, 
It is situation like this that we know a leader. You can't be said to be a representative of your people and you can't feel their plight or you can't speak up for them. No, it's unacceptable. We pray that this kind of tragedy never before any of us, in Jesus' name, in New Nigeria, is possible. Yagazir.